Hey there, it's Mick from Hamlin's Marine. Ice is almost out here in Central Maine, so uh, we know everybody's anxious to get out there and practice some social distancing and uh, maybe even catch a fish. So we got some cool rigs going on right now, and we want to take a few minutes to show you all the goodies we're putting on these boats. Um, there will be a second video. Uh, we'll show you the finished product of these rigs. But uh, right now we'll kick it over to Wyatt, and uh, he'll show you what's going on in his bag. Hello everyone, it's Wyatt from Hamlin's Marine, one of your rigging technicians here at Hamlin's. Uh, we're going to take a few minutes and go through this rig and let you know what we got going on. So I'm currently rigging up this Kodiak 165. Um, I'm stirring this bow, it's going to be this F60 Yamaha. It's a great power match for this bow. Uh, the bow of the bow is going to be this Minn Kota Edge. Uh, beneath that is going to be the quick release bracket. This gives you the option to take your trolling motor off the bow of your bow when you need to. Um, that trolling motor also is a 12 volt system and that's 55 pounds of thrust. So, for that to operate, you do need a deep cycle battery, uh, which brings me to this digital battery charger, which will charge your deep cycle battery and your starting battery both at the same time. It's a two bank charger. Um, up at the helm will be your Helix 5 second generation. It does have good downward imaging, it's a nice feature to have out on the water. Um, but other than that, that's all I have for components I'm putting on this boat, so I'm going to press it on the show. Hey, it's Sean from Bay One at Hamlin's Marine. Today I'm working on this pretty sweet fishing rig. It's the Polar Craft Frontier 189. On the bow, we're putting on this Altera trolling motor. It's got 112 pounds of thrust, and it also has iPilot. So this is a 24 volt system, so we're gonna need two extra deep cycles to keep those charged when we're not on the water. We're putting in this rebank bank Minkota Precision Charger. This will handle both deep cycles plus the starting battery. On the bow and the helm, we're putting in these Helix 7s. Um, these have mega down imaging and then they are both compatible with each other so we'll, you'll be able to get the same image on both units. Uh, to optimize fishing on this we're putting in twin Canon down riggers. These are great, they're going to get you down to 250 feet which will cover just about any lake in the state of Maine. Um, and then to finish it off we're putting on a trailer winch on the uh, tongue of the trailer. These are great for busy days on the um, busy days at the boat ramp where we need to get the boat on and off the trailer quickly. So good luck fishing and uh, stay safe. Thanks Sean and Wyatt. Those are some great rigs we got going on there and uh, just want to remind everybody we are uh, practicing social distancing protocols here at Hamlin's. We appreciate all the cooperation in that matter and if you have any questions please give us a call. We'll be happy to go over them with you. If you have any questions about the uh, products that you see in these videos give us a call also. We want everybody to be safe out there and we'll see you in the next video.